We will make this post step by step from starting. You are watching Adobe. Take pencil tool and make a curved line. Now take shaper tool and make curved smooth. Take direct selection tool and adjust curve. Now hold Alt button and drag with mouse to copy it. Select both lines and go to Object Menu and then Blend and then select Blend option. Fill 2 in the box. Now again, go to Object Menu and then Blend and then Make. Go to Object Menu and then Expand it. Ungroup this, take Line Tool and make line according to video. Now select all lines. Take Shape Builder tool and joint all shapes according to video. I skipped some part of this process, but you have to do this in all shapes. By holding Alt button, you can delete extra parts. Now we will make color code for this ribbon. I already written color code. You can pause video and note this color code. Go to fill color and paste color code. Repeat this process for all colors. Now we will select shapes for saffron color. And then we will apply gradient. Take color picker tool and select dark saffron color. Now make a point in the mid and pick a light saffron color. Repeat same process for white and green color gradient. I forget to put light green color, so I am taking light green color again. Now separate gradients, shapes form outlines. Delete lines, now place ribbon according to your choice. Adjust all gradients. The shine of all gradients should appear straight. Adjust all gradients shine.
We will apply some dark color to the back side of ribbon. Hold Alt and drag slider to make a copy of color and then darken this color a little bit and adjust gradient slider according to your choice. Now repeat same process for white and green color gradient. Now select this gradient and take eyedropper tool and pick color from upper gradient. Select all and go to object menu and group this all. and now make a light gradient background. Copy this ribbon and place according to your choice. Make a blue color outline like this. transparent this outline. Cut this all, except background, and select draw inside option. Now select paste in place. Now write your text. and apply color according to your choice. Now I will place this image Go to Transparency, select Multiply and then adjust Transparency. Cut this image and paste inside the box. Now I am placing a Shoke wheel. I already posted a video about how to make this wheel. You can also watch that video. Transparent this according to your choice.
Cut this and place inside the frame. Now your post is ready. If you liked this video, then please like this, and don't forget to subscribe our channel.